I'm Rachel Lansing, and I'll be reading a passage from Brave New World by Aldous Huxley. Why don't you let them see Othello instead? I've told you it's old. Besides, they couldn't understand it. Yes, that was true. He remembered how Hemholtz had laughed at Romeo and Juliet. Well then, he said after a pause, something new that's like Othello and that they could understand. That's what we've all been wanting to write, said Hemholtz, breaking a long silence. And it's what you never will write, said the controller, because if it were really like Othello, nobody could understand it, however new it might be. And if it were new, it couldn't possibly be like Othello. Why not? Yes, why not, Hemholtz repeated. He too was forgetting the unpleasant realities of the situation. Green with anxiety and apprehension, only Bernard remembered them. The others ignored him. Why not? Because our world is not the same as Othello's world. You can't make flivers without steel, and you can't make tragedies without social instability. The world's stable now. People are happy. They get what they want, and they never want what they can't get. They're well off. They're safe. They're never ill. They're not afraid of death. They're blissfully ignorant of passion and old age. They're plagued with no mothers or fathers. They've got no wives or children or lovers to feel strongly about. They're so conditioned that they practically can't help behaving as they ought to behave. And if anything should go wrong, there's Soma, which you go and chuck out of the window in the name of liberty, Mr. Savage. Liberty, he laughed, expecting Deltas to know what liberty is, and now expecting them to understand Othello, my good boy.